This is Insider Medicine in 60 from Chicago. According to research presented during Digestive Disease Week, pollution may be contributing to U.S. liver disease rates. Researchers found that nearly 40 percent of adults have elevated levels of alanine aminotransferase, an enzyme related to conditions like liver disease. It was then found that higher levels of heavy metals, pesticides, and mercury were linked with higher odds of having an elevated ALT. From Washington, the FDA has issued a report stating that products containing acetaminophen should carry stronger warning labels. The report cites the dangers of taking multiple products that contain acetaminophen and ingesting the drug with alcohol. It suggests that patients not take more than one acetaminophen product at a time and taking more than the recommended dose can cause severe liver damage. And finally, back to Chicago. According to a study presented during Digestive Disease Week, the incidence of Crohn's disease is increasing among adolescents. In a study of 5.8 million residents in northern France, researchers found that from 1988 to 2005, the incidence of Crohn's disease rose from 3.5 to 5.2 cases per 100,000 person years among those under age 20. The disease currently affects about 630,000 people in North America. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.